Hello everybody and welcome to this week's AVA Rigs. Uh, I'm not Joe and I'm not David, uh, but a lot of you know me as Wesley. Um, and to my left, I've got this beautiful, beautiful PC. So like, you know, everyone changes like their intros and I haven't done this in a while, so forgive me. Uh, but <clears throat> we're gonna go ahead and break down as always, uh, what's inside this bad boy, um, you know, what's primarily gonna be used for and all that good stuff. So let's uh, dive right into it, shall we? All right, so let's go ahead and just uh, break this down component by component uh, and, you know, discuss a little bit. So for the case we're going to start with is going to be a Corsair 7000D Airflow. So this is the tempered glass edition. So we do have the glass off right now so you can see inside the system and, the, you know, it really allows the components to pop. Um, you know, this tempered glass isn't, you know, dark like some fractal cases and some other cases have that option, um, but, you know, it just makes it easier for recording. Moving on to the motherboard, we're gonna have an Asus Tough Gaming Z90 plus Wi-Fi. Uh, so this is going to be an Intel board. Uh, this is a LGA uh, 1700 uh, socket. So inside that socket, we're gonna have the Intel Core i9 13900KF, and this is a 24 core processor. Um, and I mean, it's a, it's a powerhouse. It, you know, you really don't need to discuss it too much. Uh, but moving on, to the memory. Uh, so we're gonna have four sticks of Kingston 32 gigabyte Fury Beast DDR5 memory rated for 4,800 megahertz. Um, and this is the RGB edition. Uh, moving on to the graphics card, we're gonna have the Asus uh, GeForce RTX 4080. Uh, this is gonna be the tough edition. This is a 16 gigabyte card. Um, and of course this is GDDR6X memory inside of that bad boy. Now moving on to the power supply, you don't really hear this name a lot, but they're great power supplies. They're a great company. They, they make really good products. Uh, it's the Silverstone DA1000 Gold uh, Edition. Uh, so like I said, Silverstone's a really great company. Um, you know, they, they are a big name, but you know, they do get overpowered by EVGA and Corsair. Um, and you know other other manufacturers making a splash in the PSU scene, such as MSI and uh, ASUS. But you know Silverstone, uh, and for that matter, Seasonic as well. They are a big name. You know those are you know they they live in the shadows of you know EVGA and Corsair, but they're really really good power supplies. Um, you know I really don't see a lot of problems with them, and you know I work with a you know I work with parts that go bad, so you know. Take my, take my word for it, I, I promise you. Might not be tech savvy, but I can tell you, uh, they do not go bad. Very rarely they do. Um, so moving on to the AIO uh, or cooler, we're gonna have the EKWB EK Nucleus AIO. So this is gonna be a 360 millimeter uh, radiator. And then moving on to a little bit of extra cooling. So back here, it looks like we have a stock fan that comes with the case. Um, and then alongside of it, we are gonna have a set of LL120, so Corsair LL120 RGB black fans. Those bad boys are gonna be up front right there. Um, you know, again, no introduction, they're the great fans. Um, and then moving on to storage, we have a Kingston two terabyte Fury Renegade uh, SSD. Uh, this is an M.2 SSD uh, and you know, Again, they they're making a splash big. I mean, they've been in the they've been in the storage scene for a while. But you know, when you have Samsung and you know, Western Digital, Seagate, even for that matter, um, you know, again, can get overshadowed. Shadowed. Great products. I mean, Kingston is just cross the board is just great products. Uh, so then, as always, everybody knows that I like to have you know a lot of storage. And in this case, the customer also included a six terabyte Western Digital uh, Blue. Uh, this is a 5,400 RPM, uh, 3.5 HDD. So I like HDDs for, you know, backup storage. You know, things you could put, you know, <clears throat> games that you might not be playing at this moment in time, you can put them on there and then move them over to your SSD when you're ready to play them, uh, just for those faster speeds. Um, that or if you know you're, you're a content creator and you need a lot of storage for, you know, your videos or any projects you're creating. I mean, it's always good to have extra space because you move them. So uh, you can never go wrong doing that. Uh, and then to round it out, <clears throat> The customer threw in an add-in card. 
Um, and this is another Silverstone product. So uh, essentially back here or right down here, I know it's a little hard to see, uh, it's just an expansion. So you're gonna have a, a regular USB. Uh, there's gonna uh, also be a USB 3.0 uh, slot and a USB-C slot, which is nice because uh, this motherboard has a USB-C slot. Up here, there's a USB-C slot. So, you know, as we move towards, you know, primarily USB-C based um, in terms of a lot of new products, uh, you know, it's always good to have more options rather than in this case, you know, two, you know, so three, two, you know, three is better than two. Um, but beyond that, uh, and then rounding it out again, I know I said that once, so this is 100% for sure rounding it out, I promise you. Uh, just Windows 11 on this bad boy. I've talked about instabilities in the past, just, you know, a little bit, you know, at the end, like, hey, check it out. It's really cool. It does this for you. So essentially, if you don't wanna go through the process of talking to someone from our sales team or piecing together individually uh, every component, you know, maybe it's the fear of you don't know what you, well, you really don't know what you're doing. There's no shame in that. Um, you're afraid of compatibility. You don't wanna spend a lot of time like looking at, uh, is this gonna work? Um, because the, you know, things happen. You know, we do our best to make sure that you're, com you're putting components that are gonna work together. You go with an instabilder, <laughs> You really don't have to worry about that. So, you know, everything behind the scenes is gonna make sure everything works properly. Um, and you're gonna achieve, you know, what you wanna get. Well, this is what you get. So this is actually an instant builder. But, you know, there, there's just a, a couple of questions. You answer those questions, you, you know, price range, uh, resolution, uh, games. This is the end result. And I think it's really awesome to be able to show you guys like, you know, this, this was configured in like less than five minutes. I mean, I would even say maybe a little, a little less than that. It all depends. If this is a build that interests you, um, you can hop over to our Insta Builder. Uh, there will be a link down below, um, and you can configure something very easily, very quick. Uh, that is, you know, could be identical to this, honestly. Um, or you know, maybe you have different specifications. You know, who knows? But it's only a few couple clicks, answer a couple questions, and boom, you're done. Now, if you're somebody that is very uh, precise and OCD like myself, uh, when it comes to things like this, you can go to our configurator and piece together uh, the build of your dreams. Uh, whether you're doing it for workstation purposes, gaming purposes, content creation purposes, I mean, it, God, any purpose at all. Even if you just wanna get on Google and check your Gmail, yeah, you can do something like, you, you can configure it for it. Um, but if you're somebody that likes to have that assistance and get professional opinions, uh, you can talk to our sales team. Again, all that information is going to be down below. Uh, and you can also hop into our Discord. All right. So I, I manage that. Okay. You, you're going to see me active like all the time. It might say away, but I promise you, I'm, I'm probably there. Uh, but you can hop in there and you can ask us, uh, the people who actually assemble your computers, sales team and you know members of the community uh, everyone likes to give uh you know their own opinions and we encourage that this pc was coming to your house uh within a couple days from now what would be the first game you played on it all right um i mean there's so many games out there uh it's it's very overwhelming uh what would i play on it i'll probably stardew valley that's what i'm playing right now so that's the first thing that's getting downloaded i suppose if you like the pc in the video be sure to contact our sales team by emailing sales at aviadrock.com or head to the website by clicking the link within the description below you can choose from any pre-built options gaming or workstation based or use the configurator to build the pc of your dreams don't forget to click that subscribe button so you can be notified of future content and give the video a like in support of our channel you can follow the variety of our social media channels by visiting aviadirect.com forward slash community and you can also join our Discord if you wish to engage in discussions related to custom-built PCs.